Hey, what's going on? Well, by now we've probably all seen drones flying in the sky. We've got kids playing with drones. I play with drones. Even the military have been playing with drones probably long before any of us knew what a drone was, if you know what I'm saying. But imagine if a drone could have a baby with a ring doorbell, a security cam ring doorbell. Those, those doorbells that you see where someone has run off to the package. You know, they've gone up to the package on the front door and they run off with it. Well, imagine if they had a baby, a cute little baby. What would you have? You'd have a ring doorbell drone that could fly around your house. And this is what it looks like. Oh yes, this is a thing. Uh, apparently this was actually first uh, verbally released in September 2020. So a little while ago now. And uh, a lot of tech reviewers did a not an actual unboxing because this thing still does not exist. They're still making it, but they did a bit of a review on it. I mean, this is what it looks like. Today, we're going to be showing you a video on how this works. It actually flies around your house and it sees the bad boy or the bad girl, the bad man, bad woman. You know, I just can't be right with gender neutral words these days. It's just so hard. Did you guys hear about that Mr. Potato Head being turned into just Potato Head? God, what? age do we live in oh anyway <laughs> uh this is the bad boy we're going to show you a quick video but before we do this is the actual ring uh, uh .com, uh website now i will say like I, like I said this this product was actually originally released well verbally released in september 2020 now i i've done some research and i cannot find there goes my cat she's about to jump Oh, what's going on there? <gasps> big cat fight, big cat fight. Uh, I cannot find any research, any any information on this website regarding this drone. So I'm not sure if they're keeping this under wraps for now while I do more renovations. But this is the actual uh, drone, uh, what would you call it? YouTube channel? Ring? YouTube channel, I should be saying. Here's the actual video. We're going to play it a couple of times for you guys on silent because YouTube doesn't like words or songs being in certain videos. So we're gonna show you the video without any sound, but I will be the sound. Here we go. A bad man trying to sneak into a house. He set off the alarm, oh my God. Look at that, and we're gonna mute that. Look at that. The drone comes towards the man. The man's like, what the hell's going on here? Oh yes. Look at that, look at that. you actually pause the flight and uh, yeah, go all around your house. What the hell? Okay, so what's actually happening here? Well, it's only a 30 second thing. My bird, Rosie Chicken's been really noisy. Rosie, stop that. So what's actually happening here is that uh, apparently you can actually, uh, you can fly it a little bit. For, from my understanding so far, it's actually following a preset path. So when you first get the drone out of the box and you set it up, you're pretty much going to be uh, showing it the path that you want it to travel within your house. So you're going to show it. Uh, uh <laughs> now come here, ring doorbell. I want to show you my YouTube studio. You're going to be flying in between these lights. You're going to go whoosh, 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 whoosh. You're going to tell it what to do, where to do, and where to go. And uh, yeah, and then once it detects movement or something like that, it will then be able to just fly on the predetermined path. And I'm not too sure if you if you can take over it. I think probably in, in the future with a with an update you can be able to. But at the moment, I think maybe you can't. Uh, will it have sensors on it to avoid obstacles? Well, I'm not sure because the actual flight path that it'll be taking will already be preset. So these are things that we don't quite know yet. Now, when is this actually going to be coming out? Well, this is going to be coming out at some time within 2021. Now, of course, uh, uh, the, the, the ring company is owned by Amazon. So the Amazon owned uh, home security company ring has unveiled a prototype for a drone meant to fly around in your home, uh, in your house uh, called the, called the ring always home can. It is uh, set to release in 2021 sometime. Now, how much will this bad boy cost? Uh, Ring announces uh, the $250 always home can indoor drone 
and plans uh, for end-to-end -end encryption? So that's a great question. I mean, that's okay. Regarding that price, that's probably going to be 300, if not 350 Australian or British pounds. What's that going to be? Who knows? But uh, regarding hackers, now there have been a lot of uh, instances where people have got things set up uh, with on, on an internet connection. So people are now having their lights set up with internet connections, TV set up with internet connections. Everything is kind of connected to the internet now these days. And a lot of hackers, uh, for example, can manipulate these objects, such, such as looking at your webcam uh, through your computer, uh, turning lights on and off. This is a well-documented thing. Hackers are able to do this and, and they've been doing this a lot of times over many, many years. So um, as, as tech progresses, we're going to need some serious in encryption, uh, some serious security to get these new devices as secure as possible. Otherwise, imagine, just imagine for a second, like John Lennon, just imagine, Yoko Ono, that <laughs> you're, you're walking around your house naked after just having had a shower. I know, right? <laughs> and then the, 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 you, you hear the drone magically come on. And you're like, oh God, is there someone breaking into my house? No, it's possibly a hacker uh, manipulating this drone, trying to see where everybody is in the house, trying to see you naked. Uh, so it would have to have some really good security in order for this to be as secure as possible. Uh, otherwise, not a good situation. Not a good situation at all. But I think they will get it done. Uh, will, that's my table for some reason. Will they get this done? And will it be a perfect product? Uh, we don't know. Here's one more time of this video. Here we go, everybody. Now, the as you, as you guys can hear, there's a bit of music there, but I'll mute that again. And uh, so he's getting his phone out and it looks like the drone is going where it wants to go. He has a, he's not using controls, as you guys can see. Um, so you can pause the flight. Hopefully you can make it go back and forth. I'm sure these are the, these are the features that will be available at some point. Um, but yeah, wow, right? Uh, when will this be available? 2021, we don't know, but it's not even on the website. Not that I could find anyway very strange i could not find it on the actual guy's website uh yeah very strange don't know but that's a quick video regarding the uh the the ring drone would you buy one would you feel secure enough to actually use this thing i would have to get it to do a drone uh well to do a review 100 percent, I'd, I'd review this thing i've uh just here behind me if you guys can see is my downstairs staircase. Now I've got a uh, electric cord here, so we're gonna walk downstairs for a second. Can you guys see me? There we go, bye bye everybody. <laughs> so if I was to get a drone like this, or if you have an upstairs downstairs place, would you be able to use this drone uh, up and downstairs? Probably yes, but how well would it actually work in theory? Uh, like I said, that's been a quick video. You guys can find me at Tall Boy Gareth. that's my handle. On my social medias, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and I've been Gareth, I've been Paul. I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Peace out, guys. Love you all. Bye.